Thank you, Kevin. Much of the weight from a shortage in tax revenue is falling on the shoulders of our police and firefighters. The mayor told the city county council tonight those unions will have to give back their promised pay raises in order for the city to balance its budget. The cost of health insurance and pensions continue to escalate. This budget reflects those higher costs. It was standing room only as Mayor Greg Ballard presented his proposed budget for 2013, and it's not one many plan to take sitting down. But the fact that they will have to share the yeoman's uh, share of the cuts, uh, the budget reductions, has me very concerned for public safety generally in this county and also for our future ability to obtain funding. But Mayor Ballard says something has to give. Tax revenue is down, with income taxes down nearly $50 million from just two years ago. To help remedy that shortfall, he wants to reopen police and firefighter union contracts and take back $5.5 million in promised pay raises. The budget before you today is built with those same principles in mind and funds critical services of the city and county without base funding cuts in any agency. The mayor also wants to take cash from various sources, among them the Rainy Day Fund and rescind the homestead credit for property owners. It's not lost on us uh, that the mayor tonight is proposing a property tax increase on homeowners. Now, Mayor Ballard called his proposed budget fully funded and fiscally responsible and said he's looking forward to working with the council over the next two months on a final budget.